What is good, YouTube world? It's Coffee back again, man. NFL news was good, y'all. Hit the comments. Let's talk. Deshaun Watson. It's over, man. This whole situation with him in Houston, where he was sitting in limbo, the allegations, his name was cleared, and he's off to Cleveland. I saw this coming, man. When um <clears throat> I saw the way Baker Mayfield was reacting, you know what I'm saying? Uh put that message out there to Cleveland, you know, he wants to trade. That's when I really was like, yo, he's going to Cleveland. You know what I mean? And let's talk, guys. I want to know what everyone thinks about this. I'm seeing a lot of reactions going down. Like you see this picture right here where they got Deshaun, they got Cosby in a Browns uniform. And I'm seeing these Browns fans go off saying, I'm done. I'm done. I'm not I'm officially not a Browns fan anymore. I need a new team to root for. What's up, Bills Mafia? Can I fuck with y'all? Can 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 I be a Bills fan now? And what does everyone think about this? First, I want to point out, like, unrelated. I mentioned this in another video before that. The Bills and the Browns <clears throat> fans have a connection. You know, because when the Browns lost their fan, um, their team to to Baltimore, you know what I mean. Uh, when they went to the Ravens, uh, there was a, a a spot in the in the Bills Stadium. I think it was still Rich Stadium back then that they called like it was the honorary like uh, dog pound section. You know, like the Bills, the Bills and the Bills fans were like, "Yo, y'all lost your team." We're kind of neighbors. I always kind of looked at it like the Bills and the Browns being cousins in a sense. I've mentioned that before in videos. You know what I mean? When we play each other, it's called the Battle for Lake Erie. They're right there. We're right here. And, you know, they were like, hey, come on over. We got you. You know, you can, the, the dog pound can do their thing here. And, you know, they got their team back. That's all history is behind the, the Browns or whatever, and I felt really bad for them. You know what I mean? We know all us Bills fans, Bills Mafia, that feeling when it's up in the air, if your team, you're going to lose your team or not, a terrible feeling, man. Thank God for Terry P Pagula. We've been over that a bunch of times. So, but, like, peep this tweet. Well, after 30 years, minus the stolen years of Browns fandom, I'm done hoping the Bills and Bills Mafia will welcome me with open arms first folding table is on me and then this person hey bills mafia sup like they don't they, 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 these fans are like saying they ain't fucking with like deshaun watson in their eyes um is guilty you know what i'm saying someone else commented and put deshaun watson this this whole situation this deal is a black eye for the nfl like what does everyone think of this man um his name was cleared it seems a lot of people don't believe that he was innocent. Um, let's see. Here's a couple other tweets. Well, Browns, I'm not rooting for Deshaun Watson, which means I need a new team to root for. I'm feeling maybe the Bills Mafia. Buffalo gets Lake Effect Snow. Another similarity. You know what I'm see saying? The, the battle for Lake Erie. That Lake Effect Snow. You live in Buffalo, Cleveland, Detroit, Minnesota, some other places you know about lake effect snow you know about that real winter life man but anyways um let me continue on with that buffalo gets lake effect snow they have that chip on their shoulder grit i admire and i rooted for them in the playoffs should i join so there's been multiple reactions i've seen like this a lot of browns fans are saying they're done they cannot like the sean watson coming there they don't want no part of it and then uh, i'm seeing other people speaking about Kaepernick too like you see one QB kneels during the national anthem and was slash is essentially blackballed the other QB had 22 women accuse him of actual misconduct and the Browns give him 230 milli um he's good at football because he's good at football and women slash minorities continue to take L's and it hurts every time we are reminded where we stand what do y'all think about uh, these reactions and everything, you know? Does the fact that he was accused but his name was cleared, like, wh what does everyone think about that? Um, this guy says, so the NFL and NFL commission condone illegal actual misconduct so much so that they had allowed the accused to be, 
They allowed the accused to be the highest paid player in its history. Meanwhile, kneeling is bad. I have no side here, but it all seems icky and lacks integrity. <laughs> Let's talk, guys. Seriously, um, anyone new catching this video, I always put it out there. Jay Coffee talks all about hearing what the people got to say. We can indeed agree to disagree if need be. But, um, you know, with Deshaun Watson, they, like... It seems what's going on, what is hard for people to say, okay, he's innocent, or I don't know. Like, it just seems a lot of people don't look at it that way. It's the sheer, it's the number of accusers. Now, I'll put this out there. I do want to put this out there. Uh, there were official reports of this, but it didn't, it didn't really, the story didn't really get legs. You didn't hear much more about it. The feds were investigating the attorney and some of the accusers for extortion. They were saying, um, I don't know, I saw, I saw that some people theorized that this was some BS. I don't know. I don't know. I, I put it out there. I don't know what to make of all this, but I want to know what you guys think. And then, and then look at this tweet, too. The AFC is absolutely loaded at QB. Bengals got Burrow. Bills got Allen. Broncos got Russell Wilson. That's... Don't forget about Russ coming to the AFC. Browns, Deshaun Watson, Chargers, Herbert. Oh, my bad. Um, Chiefs, Mahomes, Raiders, Car, or Raiders, Car, Ravens, Lamar Jackson. Good luck, Patriots. <laughs> Mac Jones is a buster. But um, I don't know. It just seems people are not going to um, – let Deshaun Watson forget he was accused in many people's eyes. Those allegations and accusations equal he did it. And, and once again, comment and let me know what you guys think. I really believe that it's the sheer number of accusers, how many there was, is why people can't seem to let it go. You see, like these Browns fans want nothing to do with their team anymore. I really want to know. What everyone feels about this personally, like, do you feel, um, you know, he did it. He's no good. He's a wicked individual. Do you feel it was some BS um, or do you feel like indifferent, not indifferent, but like you don't know where to stand in the middle. You're just kind of like, I don't know. You know what I mean? I, I'm curious to know, because obviously if someone really did that, no one does want them playing in the NFL. But um, from my understanding. You know, uh, the investigation went through, and um, the, you know, charges never came up. Came and this is kind of stupid. I should actually be up on this myself, being that I'm giving commentary on this. But what ended up happening with the civil side of things? Did he? Did he? Um, did he settle? Did he make payments? Get in the comments. Let me know. Um, something I was pointing out the other day as well with Antonio Brown. If you guys recall, there was allegations against him. He ended up coming back to the NFL. And uh, when those allegations were going on, right, it became public um, record or public info that the accuser that ended up, you know, that's when all that BS happened. <clears throat> Excuse me, with AB, where he went to the Raiders. Once again, I'm so glad he didn't end up coming to my Bills. I remember feeling so disrespected when he did my franchise like that. But he got traded to the Raiders, pulled a bunch of BS there, then ends up getting traded to the uh, – Erno gets cut, the Patriots pick him up. And then when the, the news came out, Patriots cut him, and he's out of football for like a year, right? Well, it became news that um, the accuser – basically had given AB a date and was like, hey, if you settle with me by this date and pay the money, this all goes away. If you don't, I'm going to the NFL. This is becoming public info, and that's how we're rocking. And um, I don't know. You know, what do you think, guys? Do you think there's people trying to shake down some of these athletes and these allegations are lies? Do you think it's true? Uh, let's discuss it all below. But also, let's talk a little bit about Deshaun Watson getting this big money. Do you guys think he's been keeping in shape? I mean, listen, um, however you feel, like right now we're strictly talking about Deshaun's abilities as a quarterback. We know this guy is a hell of a QB, okay? Um, 
the Browns always end up like for the past however many however many years they've had a lot of talent, and you know there's a lot of hype surrounding them, but they just can't get there. They can't get over the hump. You know if Deshaun Watson is uh, able to you know go join that franchise and get back to where he was when we last saw him in Houston. You know if he's been if he's mentally focused and um, he's ready to play and all that. This is a big deal for the Browns, you know what I mean? This guy's dangerous. This guy's dangerous, man, out there. But I don't know, I'm just rambling on a little bit. I, I saw this news. Um, you know, for the longest time, I knew Deshaun was going to play in the NFL again. I, like, he sat out this whole season, you know, just not playing but getting paid. And um, I don't know. I knew, I knew this wasn't going to happen for another season, but... You see a lot of fans here, and these this does this is some tweets and stuff. And although I only snatched up a few of them here, believe me, there is a lot of tweets that echo these sentiments. I just grabbed a couple to share with y'all as examples, but it seems a lot of fans feel very strongly about this that they ain't plucking with their team no more. So let's just oh and uh, Kaepernick, I keep seeing his name being thrown out there. People are very upset where they're saying Cap. They believe he was blackballed from the league for his protest and everything. And uh, But Deshaun, you know, in their eyes did what he did. And here he is. So all this stuff, let's discuss it in the comments. Is Deshaun no good to you? What do you think this means for the Browns? Um, and also, guys, stay tuned. Lots of lots of NFL content coming. I've been slacking on my Mac in a little bit with these with these videos and whatnot. But we're gonna get back to it, as uh, well as many other stuff. You know, it's Jay Coffee Talk. I fuck with y'all. Um, appreciate you guys tuning in. I gotta go. Peace.